First I'm watching The Meg 2, The Trench I believe it's called. The first movie was pretty good actually, very entertaining. I mean the story was mad but it was very entertaining, had some really good jump scares and some really cool shots as well. So I'm really looking forward to this one. Before we do though, how are y'all doing? I hope you're doing great. I'm doing great now as well, feeling a lot better than I was. Still a little bit sick though, not completely out of it yet, but like I said, feel really good. So yeah, let's just do it without any further ado. Here we go. All right, the mood is set, lighting and everything's good to go. It's not exactly scary in the normal sense but it is pretty scary so i'm going with that vibe you know the cretaceous period 65 million whoa okay i was gonna say so what like dinosaurs and stuff and then we see lizards oh lovely okay lovely definitely all right cool Little ones feeding on the big ones, eh? Man, imagine if these things still existed. Like, what the hell, man? Oh, these ones can swim. Wait, can all dinosaurs swim? So like, get away from my bro. Little ones before I crush ya. Between my large teeth. Yeah. Keep running away. <laughs> They're back. Okay. That's the Megalodon, yeah? That is... It's a Michael Jackson song, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Wow, that really changed my mood. I was really scared, and then that music music came on. And I was like, "Okay, let's do this." Ah, oh, so this is Jason Statham. I've heard of his name. I haven't seen him in anything, but yeah, the action star who can single-handedly take on a shark. Cause obviously, <laughs> that's the inside of the megalodon. He's getting out of. <laughs> <laughs> he smuggled his way in through that. Look, it's Walter White. Get it? Because it's the danger. <laughs> you know, anyways, come on, man. Can it talk? I love parrots. I had one when I was little. Yay, he can talk. Yeah, checking on uh, security protocols and... Um few pictures so small nice i'm like there's no way he's selling that off the way he's dressed and everything you know what i mean and look like someone on official business well unofficial business just not that kind of an official business you know he should have just told him i'm jason statham they would have just been like, oh, okay, well, you're going to break us, literally. So, here you go. Go on, continue doing what you want to do. You beat a shark. <laughs> We're nothing in front of you, almighty Statham. You want to see the warrant? It's right in my pocket. <laughs> That's... So close to the ship. I'm awesome. I'm about to. Oh, it looks like a shark. <laughs> Scooped him up right like a fish out of water. Initiating suit power up. Clear. I kind of looks like a fin, you know. I am. Twenty-one percent. Oh, you can use it. Okay. I mean, if you're gonna take on the megalodon, you're gonna need many suits like that. Is that that little girl? She's all grown up now, or am I being racist by saying all Asians look the same? I'm Asian myself, so <laughs> South Asian, but you know, Asian still. 
于是我们把他带回来治疗抚养。海奇变得很热情。Massive. We have been able to create the technology to pass through the thermocline, a thermal layer of freezing cold. Mm-hmm. Tell the tale. We give you, ladies and gentlemen, Jonas Taylor. Oh, I for a second thought he was going to say Jason Statham. I know this was your idea. I'm going to kill you. Smile and pretend you love it. Have fun. Go on, give him a hug. Sorry, mate. Why not? I'm almost diving all the time at my age. Not to twenty-five. Oh, it is her. Okay. <laughs> That's a closed one. Every system on Mono One, every dive protocol, and every animal we've seen down there. <sighs> Look how all the structures are kind of like fish like, John. You know I mean, why are you swimming with the mech, you mean? I'm conducting an experiment. There it is. Oh, oh you bad bitch. I am. He actually trained. Uh oh. She's not responding. Come on, Heidi. There she is. No, she is responding. Oh. Hold the cord. Twenty meters. Do they get out of there? It's fine. Did he get him? I don't know. I think he pulled the thing and he's out. Maybe I think this is like a. Suspense thing, or there he is. Yep, get out. The problem is that it's a Meg, and you're a snack. He is a snack. <laughs> I mean, pause. Even that, I don't know if I'd do that. It's just that scene in the last one. Remember, even with her when she was little. Wow. Morning, everyone. Let's get this. We are exploring Area 19, collecting rock samples. I was going to say, why would you have such an exposed area? Like, for something that huge and that destructive, that was kind of shit. You would expect there to have a couple more of those, you know, before it actually gets out. Or was it supposed to get out? Dress off. Uh, yeah. Cosplay. Do you want to see a million photographs? <laughs> More like you're a mouth breather. It totally is. It's got a deviated septum. My nose is a little crooked here too. During fight. In the ring, not, you know. <laughs> See what the problem is. This is your 26 trench dive without incident. Slubs of electric predator, countermeasures, and emergency dive suits. Famous last words. Because obviously. Got company. Guys, it's a mag. Yep. That's not possible. They can't go through the thermocline. It's not come from the thermocline. I'm tracking it from the shore. Yeah. That little fence that you put or whatever, vent or whatever that you put. That was supposed to stop the Meg. Come on, fam. She's right above us. Why? Entering the thermocline. Oi. Ooh. It's frightening to look at, man. Oh, I was just gonna say, jump scare ain't coming. When it goes that quiet, it's always a jump scare. Many of them. Way. Yes, way. Nothing I've ever seen. That's gotta be the apex predator. Damn. Right now, we are perfectly safe. Ah, oh, famous last words. We gonna follow some giant sharks to an unknown sector? Man, here's some dumbass shit. Mark my words. <laughs> you know what? Uh, it is so realistic. Like, it, it's... Why would you... Like, in these movies, why do they do these things? I mean, I guess this is their job. So this makes a little bit of sense. A little bit. Still, you should be prepared. They're not fully prepared for this. Custabon. Nice catch. No. 
Nice. Guys, what's happening? I'm reading a thermocline breach. Something's ripped a giant hole in it. That's yeah. All of this is gonna come to the surface. All the megs and everything. Oh my god, I thought it was a meg, that's just a rock. Dive one, dive two, do you copy? What could go wrong? We're perfectly secure. Everything is. Don't you know that you're in a movie called The Meg 2, The Trench? <laughs> that's what's wrong. <laughs> We're gonna walk back across the trench and make it into that seafloor station. Yeah. Boots have two hours here tops. They're only designed for brief extra. We'll go slow and steady. Don't I'm gonna punch the crap out of those megs if they show up. Come on, let's do this. Come on, quickly. You got two hours. Oh, and I have unlimited time. The trench. 25,000 feet deep. I mean... Yeah. It's a good thing it's a fantasy movie or a scary movie. You know. What the hell are you doing? Saving your ass. And walking back... Just the ass. The rest they can take. Could be... Paintballer? Like the ultimate team building exercise? <laughs> yeah. Away from the I'd help relax yourself a little, you know, take your mind off of this 25,000 feet deep in the ocean, in the trench with the Megs and the biggest one they've ever seen. Hey. Just appeared as well. Look, look at this. It's beautiful. Is this Pandora? Oh, you... No touching stuff. Okay. That was not nice. Uh -huh. Okay. <clears throat> I mean, that didn't scare me at all. Definitely not. <laughs> oh, fuck. They've, they've got me twice now. Real hard. Regis, cover our six. Shoot anything that moves. Us. What if we move? You gonna shoot us too? This guy. If they get there, we are screwed. Double game. Post out there. Are those like bones of animals, or is that like a plant, like fishies? I mean, keeps going in and out. Well, they were mating, so it makes sense that it keeps going in and out. Oh my God, that's a spider thingy! Wow. Yeah. I'm getting a reading. Any context to right? I like the child, you know? She's she's holding on pretty well, considering everything that's happening. <laughs> it's those things from 65 million years ago. They're fish dinosaurs. <laughs> nice. And these are the little ones. Imagine the big ones. That's what I'm saying. Like, man, we're lucky they're gone. <laughs> nice. Let's go. Uh oh, punch it. Punch it. Oh. Oh. Okay. I thought this might attract them as. Lovely. Everybody He's gonna come after him? He's trying to run away from them? You really wanna die, don't you? There you go. Nice. Nice thinking there. Uh oh, oh! Don't just relax. She's just chilling down there. All she needs is Netflix. Oh, she's 13. Let, uh, scratch that. Pause. I didn't know. <laughs> it's not too far. You can make what it. could go wrong? You stupid. <laughs> oh, munchies. Let's go. Snack time. Gotta go. We don't know. Uh oh. Quickly. 
Quickly! Rigus, come on! They're gonna... Nah... Yeah. Ooh, they got in. Okay, cool. my god that much that's it and her head disappeared literally a matter of seconds it was life or death hey, Regus. let's try to keep it together we ain't had the wow that makes you think doesn't it Literally seconds, man. Difference between life and death. Wow. Billion dollars. Billion with a P. Yeah. <laughs> Billion with a P. Pillion. These are my designs. Mm hmm. How do they have this? They have two teams working on this. <laughs> Again? It's not gonna work. Oh, this is how it's gonna open. Yep. Lovely. Push down, not up. <laughs> Guys, that wasn't me. I got trapped. I have full control of the station and I've locked down this room. What are you doing, Jess? Double game. It's a bluff. No, 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 it's a bluff. Come on. Do it. Yeah, yeah, he, he understood. He understood. Yeah, this is a bluff. Yeah, I think the other guy understands too. You're gonna do it. Do it! Oh, sorry. Oh, okay. Thought they were gonna like fake his death or something to get out of this. Mm, I suppose not. I've already dispatched a cleanup crew to Mana One. Oh. Where we came in, a duty override. You have no suit. Yeah. Work. Aren't they like 20, 50 billion miles uh, deep? <laughs> billion with a P. Anyone can do this. It's you. <laughs> if anyone can do this, it's you. And if anyone can do it, it's me. So you go. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Won't it be crushed by the pressure? Yeah. It's about air. It reacts under pressure. And that's why he has to blow it out of his sinuses. Wow. Is that true? That just, I don't know, that doesn't seem real. The oh, hell, man. Oh, lovely. Perfect timing. Oh, lovely. He's going to get crushed too. Pick up that rock. Or coal or whatever that's supposed to be. There you go. Boom. Easy does it. I was just gonna say, look behind ya. It's amazing the lengths people will go to just for money, you know, like how many people died and how many, how much it affects the environment as well. Like you don't have to be like an activist or something, but just deliberately doing things to hurt the environment, like it make any sense. What is the point of that money if you don't have an environment to live in? Are you gonna enjoy it? Use it, you know? We need a distraction. Let out the station. The max will attack it. Yeah. And kill us. Not if we're fast enough. Yeah, you gotta get out of here, though. Is that guy gonna attack him or something? There's only one guy, by the way. There's nobody else? Was one guy, I suppose, but you know what I mean. He's gonna make it. No, you have to close the hatch! You're gonna make it still? Oh, no. He had to make this decision in the previous one as well. That 
was close. Two. Very. Yeah, three close. You thought about it, though. Yeah, we thought about it. Didn't we, Regus? <laughs> It's sorrow. <laughs> Boys? The Meg's the last of your concern that dude is still alive. Open up. <laughs> Sorry. Sleepy time. Run, 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 run. That actually worked. I thought it was gonna not gonna work at all, but what's that? Trouble. They've taken over. But don't worry. You've got Jason Statham. He can fight a Meg with his bare hand. Doesn't even need a suit. Pressure in the trench. Who? <laughs> That's kind of crazy, though. I really want to know. Like, is that a really a thing? They really told us that you can survive 25,000 deep. Like, I know it's J J Jason Statham and he's got a deviated septum, but really? <laughs> I am this guy Jason Satham who come on let's do this I was so hoping one of the I'm not hoping but like also kind, kind of hoping one of them would hit the bike I'll jump in off come here baby come here bam yeah you know that ta taser thing was bigger than that bag and that gun is about the size of that bag as well How's he fitting all that in there? Oh, lovely. You got this? Hmm. This is the guy, this is the uncle. Lovely, let's go. I thought you were dead. Wishful thinking, Mike. Thank the deviated septum. The deviated septum. Do we care? They're not dead. Not a big problem. Megalodon. Z with a Z. We tracked three megs that escaped. A billion of them with a C. Yeah, I'm on it. I was also thinking. Lovely. You stupid. And this guy. Don't eat him. Like fully. Eat him little by little. <laughs> Savor them. You know, like the movie The Menu. Don't eat taste. What about the first hundred yards? That's where we go die. We paddle huh? out slow. <laughs> no engines. Minimal more. <laughs> it won't look like He's the voice of reason. What happened last time? Oh. That's what happened. Let's not bring him back alive. Ooh, that's making a lot of noise and also the vibrations and stuff, right? That's that's probably attracting. Right now. Yeah. That's probably attracting. Yep. The Megs. Be still. No motion whatsoever. I have to show. Take it. Take it. Well, they took it. You never specified who should take the... <laughs> yep, he ate him. You never specified who should take the shot. The Meg heard you and it took the shot. Lovely. There's only a couple of places they could make it to. Are you crying, Montez? That bitch. Shut the fuck up, man. That really annoyed me. Turn of the match? Negative. Negative, huh? Fun Island? Hey, let's go. Fun Island. Is there like a show called? No, that's Love Island. Never seen it. Heard a lot about it, though. It's like, I, I feel like it's one of those shows that people watch just to hate it. Do you know what I mean? That sort of thing. What are they running for? The big tings. <laughs> oh, all of these are, I mean, they're snacks. Yeah, but they're going to be literal snacks. Who does that? Who ruins paradise for other people? Up some oil on my back? How about my front? <laughs> Ew. Like I just said, who ruins literal paradise, and now he's ruining their paradise, you know what I mean? <laughs> oh no, he's gonna propose, and as she says yes, the shark is also gonna say yeah. <laughs> yeah? Yep, there you go, there you go. That's the, the, yep, she, oh, she's gone! 
There's something in the water. Oh, that might be like a sign thing, you know, the thing that has the lights and stuff. Yeah, yeah, it's those things, all right. What the hell was that? That wasn't a shark. Was that the... This doesn't look good. The thing? Vegas. What's it called? The thing. <laughs> Starro. Not Starro. Starro's like starfish or whatever. The... <laughs> the octopus. There you go. The big one. Who saw earlier? On islands about to be really fun. It came to the land. That is what's gonna eat ya, and not in the fun kind of way. See that light got tower? Yeah. You go there and you stay there. This is not one of those things where I tell you to do something. You say yes, and then you do whatever you want. <laughs> <laughs> no matter with me. Can't do what I need to do if I'm worried about you. You're fine. Promise me you'll come back. You know I love you. Mm. Three Megalodons, one Jason Statham, but it's all right. He's got a deviated septum. He's got this. Now it's really fun island. Come on then. Oh, 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 what a shot. Oh, that was scary. That was good. Sunny, check that out. Sunny, side up. No, 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 don't. What? That's so stupid. Like you got in the chopper to get away. Why would you tell him to, to turn the chopper off or whatever? I don't know how choppers work and check. You fly away. Everybody died. Don't you see? I mean, don't because fuck you. But like, you know what I mean? That's stupid. And we're agreed. Yeah, good. Great. <laughs> yeah, I like how she's just chilling here. You just saw all those creatures kill people and her first instinct was no, 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 stop. Let's wait here. Let's, let's, uh, uh, let them have at least a little bit of a nibble, you know? I hope they shred you apart. <laughs> hey, lovely. There's a little pet. Yeah, fun time. On Fun Island. Ooh. They're really gonna have a party. Walk. Yeah. Amphibion. That clothes gonna look like my shirt. Really? Condoms? <laughs> Emergency stuff. They have a gum in your mouth. Stick the glass. Lovely. I'm not sure? Oh. Of course he's gonna do this. Which one of us has a deviated septum? Me? All right, cool. Then I'm going. Duh. Come on. Now. Stupid. <laughs> that, that's what I was talking about. Fun Island. You know, those things. I thought that was that woman's clothes or something. Like she was eating and her clothes rose to the top. Do you know what I mean? That sort of thing. But no. Nah. Earlier when the guy was proposing. Anyways, who cares? <laughs> Oh, that was a good shot. Oh, no. Fuck. Even your deviated septum is not going to help here. There you go. Ooh, hoo -hoo, lovely. See, a bit more of this. This is what I wanted, man. They had so much bullshit in the middle. <laughs> Nice Okay, Regus. On the count of three. <laughs> you didn't hear her run away? I guess he was too focused on not dying, you know. Okay. Oh, ah! But that exposes you as well. No, Grab the bag, yay! Let's go. Nice. Where are you going? Stealing a chopper. What chopper? Global rescue. Well, it says helipad, so there must be a heli on the pad. 
guard, the coast guard, anybody, just come now. The point guard. <laughs> No. Come on, you've only got a few. There are like three of them total, right? And there are three Megalodon! How the hell is a ski or whatever that is, is sur like able to sustain all of this? Got him. Wow. Like, obviously kill them, because it's either them or you, but, like, also, that's devastating, man. We need a plan. We have to lead it away. Feed them the stuff, the nitrate or whatever. Why did he throw the hammer? He could have used it to hit the, you know, when, when if they attack, like, use it as a weapon. Like that. Now, if that was a hammer, that would have done a lot more damage. That was a close one. Oh, lovely. We gotta go. Run. Run. I hate this in these damn movies. When they, like, defeat one and they know there are 50 others, but they just relax and freeze. You're gonna bite the pipe? They're fueling it right as they're using the fuel as well. Oh no. Oh no. Shower them with gas. If they drink that, will they die? Will it poison them? What the hell? Oh my goodness. He, I suppose he's also got a deviated septum then, yeah? If, he, if he's going to do stuff like that, he must. Yeah, it's definitely the thing. Yeah, let, let's go. Oh, this guy. Yeah, crush him. Fucking creep. <laughs> Are you kidding me? These people are fucking stupid. Fun Island. Well, they're having fun. I'm having fun watching. That is Fun Island. I would have thought the shark would follow the bigger boat. I'd assume more food to eat, right? <laughs> Doggo. He lost lost his last harpoon thingy, right? What the hell? It wrapped around him. I was gonna say it wrapped around the heli. Whoa, nice. Chop chop. Bro! What is that? Is it I thought it was like a bottle. What? Yeah, see how, like, he just, like, was standing there waiting for it to attack him? Like, the fuck? Run! <laughs> uh oh. Because he's still alive? Get me over there! These guys, I swear. Deal with this situation first! Then worry about your personal vendettas. Yeah, instead of shooting him with a gun, let's hit him with a gun, yeah. And there's blood. And sharky sharky boom, man! <laughs> yeah, I guess it is. You got the gun? Yeah. I won't be needing this. Yeah, you couldn't do it. There you go. Nice catch. See you later, chum. Hit it with the thing. Yeah, he's got a machete. Hit him with a machete. Oh, it's got a butthole. Put it in his butthole. Oh, that's an eye, maybe. No. 
Okay, you got it. Cool. Nice. Where are you going, bitch? <laughs> Come back here. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. That's his butthole, right? <laughs> I think that was his mouth. Oh, let's go. Oh, nice. There you go. Come on, fam. Lovely. You know, I was wondering this, like, why is this shark going after these little humans instead of this big ass thing? Like, you want food? You're huge. You know, you can't feed and stuff like that. He humans are just a snack. We're not going to be enough. Go after that big thing. That's the that's the main course. How the hell is he able to lift that wing and... I suppose it's the deviated septum. Uh. I would let it go and run. Oh, nice. It's gonna fall on you, like... It's not gonna stay like that forever. Oh, it's dead. Come on. Oh, I guess it didn't fall on him. I thought it was gonna like fall on him. He's getting trapped under it. That's a lot of weight to remove, do you know what I mean? Wow, an absolute behemoth. A megalodon. I swear if this puppy gets got, I'm not gonna be happy. All these other humans, you know. That's fine. Eat them. Eat them all. That's not fine, but... Hey, let's go. Did he need to dive? That's actually really counterproductive, diving. Diving makes it... <laughs> it makes it difficult because you're moving. It's, you know, difficult to aim. No, it's okay. That's right, He's got the thing. It's gonna go away at the last second. Yeah, at the last second, it's gonna move away. There it is. Close its mouth. Lovely. I have a special bird. Went after the dolphins. Yeah. She obeyed my command. Yeah, it did one after the do dolphins. I believe it before and I don't believe it now. Hey, Mac, back me up. Yeah, yeah, before she changes her mind. <laughs> I, I think so too. I don't think there's taming that thing. It just it changed her mind like that, John. I mean, you didn't obey any command. Shut up. <laughs> oh, look at all that blood. Sometimes there's a situation and <laughs> I'm glad you finally understand. I'm proud of you. Get out of the water, you know that they're still out there, right? Man, we got a lot of people. Of course, when everything's done, then these bitches show up. <laughs> the water was cold, it wasn't that cold, but yeah. Today, we count our blessing. Here's to being alive. Here's the dolphins. What about those things that can live off the ground and on the ground both? You should be like leaving this place and going as far as you can. But I love you anyway. Mm, she definitely loves the uncle more. That was kind of like a half hug. Not buying it. <laughs> Are these guys really just chilling out here? Like, they, and like a few feet away from the water as well. Like even the Meg can get you. Let alone those things that can crawl on the ground. So I guess there's going to be a Meg 3 as well then. They didn't really resolve it. All right, that's the end of the movie. Cool. Or like a post credit scene or something. No, Mech 2, The Trench. Alrighty then, that was uh, quite a movie. It was interesting. It was a weird one. Uh, yeah, I'd say I liked the first one way more because there was a lot more Meg action going on. Do you know what I mean? Here it was, it was a bit too much like going on, which I didn't like all that much. I liked the parts when it was about the Megs. They had some really amazing shots and really scary moments and really 
cool and badass moments, you know. That's all great, but they're so convoluted with like all this two groups and they're just fighting and why are they fighting for some dumbass reason? Like no one cares about that, John. I mean, I think the first movie, I, I if they just stick to that formula, I think these movies can be really entertaining. And this was really entertaining too, when it was about what the movie's called. Mm -hmm. The Meg, you know, uh, but when it was about all the other stuff, like I'm like, all right, give us a scene, right? Five minutes. Let's move on. Yeah, great. They had a little bit of that in the first movie as well, obviously. And I suppose you, you, you need to have that. You can't just all be like action, all that. You need to have a little bit of a setup midpoint and the end and all that. You know what I mean? So that's fine. But like in this one, I think they had, they were trying to do too much and I just didn't, I'm not a fan. Do you know what I mean? Like when you, when you see a movie such as the Meg or Meg 2 or whatever, movies like this, you're not here for any of the, you know, amazing messages or something. Like if it has those messages, great. And I suppose this tried to have those messages the, about the environment and about corporate greed and you know, evil people and this and that and the other. But it's just like so generic and so like, meh that you're like ah to whatever can we move past this like well <laughs> i don't care man but besides that stuff i really enjoyed the the scary stuff the stuff where the megs are attacking and the almost a tarantula the spider looking fish the octopus do you know what i mean uh there was actually a, a spider looking fishy there in the trench as well uh we had like those little dinosaur thingies I can swim and um, come to the ground. So if those things exist, and we saw at the start, they were like from way, way back, whatever age they said, you know, um, when actual huge dinosaurs like the T-Rex and them boys existed, does that mean then they're, those guys are, well, but this is underwater, so I guess animals that couldn't survive in water wouldn't have survived i was gonna say are, do, are they gonna have like dinosaurs and stuff maybe in the third one because there will be a third one let's be honest they didn't really resolve uh the issue here the meg's still out there you know all the, the trench is still out there everything's open still they've got this huge ass hole in the trench as well now so there's that whole thing going on so there's definitely going to be the, uh, another movie for sure. But um, yeah, man, it, that, like I said, these movies are not to be taken seriously. They're fun. They're enjoyable. You you sit back, you watch it, you, you make shitty jokes like I tried to. And you just have fun. And it was fun. And it was very entertaining. And, you know, uh, like I said, these are the only two movies that I've seen from Jason Statham. But I've heard so much about him from so many different people that I kind of know what he's all about. So I get it. I I'm, I, I would definitely want to see more of his stuff because it's just entertainment. It's just silly fun. You just sit back, relax, and just enjoy. And you get a couple of scares. And do you know what I mean? Like there are tense moments. There are exciting moments. There are thrilling moments there are funny moments there's lots of action there's explosions big monsters deviated septums oh man it's just great fun overall it's entertainment at its best and that's really what this was and i loved it i enjoyed the movie i do think it was a bit long do you know what i mean like there were certain parts that you could have just taken out and honestly like perfectly honest it wouldn't matter you can, there are huge chunks in this movie that you can take out and throw it out the window and you have the exact same movie, do you know what I mean? So that's why I'm saying like it was unnecessarily long, like it was, I don't mind a two hour long movie, but it has to, you have to make it count. You can't just make it two hours just because you want a two hour movie, do you know what I mean? And I feel like this is what, this movie is one of those, uh, it had certain scenes where you're like, okay, why did I need to see that? Like that, what, what does that add to the story? Do you know what I mean? <laughs> but yeah. Overall, great fun. Really enjoyed it. I definitely loved the first one more. The first one was amazing. I think they had a great formula for the first one. They should have stuck to that one. They tried to add a bit more stuff in this one. It eh, didn't really work, for me at least. Do let me know what your thoughts are on this one. Did you enjoy? Did you not enjoy? What parts did you like? What parts did you dislike? You already know what I think. So let's get down in the comment section and let's get talking. If you want to see the full length reaction to this, want to see the whole movie with me, you can. It's available on my Patreon. Link in the description to my Patreon. Also, these videos go up early on my Patreon as well. So all the movies and the shows and everything that I do, uh, they go up first on Patreon and then they come over to YouTube. Thank you so much, every single one of you for supporting me all this time. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Until then, have a nice...